So where I was working before at the theatre, um, there was this little place nearby called the Stock Market, and I thought that was such a clever name because what they sold was stock, like soups and stocks and stuff that you could put in your meals. And uh, reminds me of my mum because my mum uh, always used to keep stock in the fridge. She would have a stock pot, and um, so whenever she cooked a meal, she'd like turn the remains into stock to put into something else, like a soup or a risotto or something. And uh, sad to say, <laughs> my family, when I was younger, we weren't very supportive of my mum's efforts in making stock. Admittedly, it did make things taste better, but when you'd look at the stock in the fridge, it was just so unappetizing that, you know, we, we kind of made fun of her for it. So, yeah, sorry about that, Mum. We also got in trouble many, many times for throwing out stock, something that was left on a bench that she was going to turn into stock. And then we'd throw it out, not realizing that it wasn't junk. <laughs> and uh, got yelled at a few times for that. Oops. Sorry. Well, she uh, might be glad to know, my mother, that there is justice in the world because now I'm turning into her and the other night I decided to keep some stock after my dinner. Um, I turned the remains into stock and I put it in a little um, a disposable container and I put it in the fridge and um, I was quite happy with my efforts of making stock. And Lo and behold, the next morning I got up and the empty container was on the bench and my roommate had thrown it out or something. Maybe she drank it, that would be weird. No, I'm guessing she just tipped it down the drain. I actually wasn't even angry, I was just completely baffled. Um, yeah, so that's my story about the stock. I just had to share a bit about the stock market because isn't it such a clever name? <laughs> yeah, um, yeah. Okay, so now I'm gonna go have lunch. Stockless lunch. No stock in it. No.